How to install the BT Chino Easy Connected Kit, category number 318013. Let's start by opening the box. Included in the kit is the hands-free video internal unit. A set of screws, screwdriver, and extra plugs. The entry panel with speaker, camera, and microphone. The power supply with the installation manual. For the installation, you will require a Phillips screwdriver and an additional smaller screwdriver, spirit level, scissors, two wire twisted cable for wiring, a probe to feed wire through corrugated conduit, a welder, and two pieces of heat shrink tubing. Using the probe, feed the cable from the hands-free internal unit to the location of the connected outdoor unit. Fix the rain cover to the wall at a height of about 160 centimeters from the ground. Use the spirit level to ensure it is installed straight. Next, open the external module, unscrewing the two torque screws with the included key. Remove the lower cover to access fixing screws to mount the unit. For convenience, we recommend disconnecting the blue terminal to connect the wires from the hands-free internal unit. Using the diagram found in the installation manual, connect the two wires from the internal unit to terminals D1 and D2 respectively. Replace the terminal to the outdoor unit and attach the module on the rain cover. In your kit, you'll find a M2.5 Torx screw. Use this to fix the external module to the rain cover. Replace the cover which hides the microphone and secure it with the two Torx screws removed earlier. Now, let's mount the internal unit. First, fix the metal bracket to the wall. Mount the unit approximately 160 centimeters from the ground and using a spirit level, ensure that it's straight. Run the power supply through corrugated conduit. The plug will not fit through the conduit, so an extension must be built using the two flying connectors, which can be found in the kit. Use the diagram on page four of the manual to complete this step. You will need to weld two wire cable to the red and black wires from the female connector, and then weld the other side of the cable to the black and two colored black and white wires to the male connector. Now, let's connect the internal monitor by inserting the 90 degree power plug into its socket. Using the wiring diagram found in the manual, connect the wires coming from the external unit to the D1, D2 terminals located on the green terminal of the internal unit. Attach the monitor to the wall bracket and connect the power supply plug to a power point and turn it on. The wiring installation is now complete.